Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tiana and in today's video I am going to be showing you guys what I got from the Victoria's Secret semi-annual sale this year. So I have everything in this bag. This bag is just like for decoration because I've had it in my house for a while and I just thought that it looks cute. It like ties in the whole background. But anyways, I went to the Victoria's Secret sale um, I went to the actual store and what I will say is I felt honestly so safe shopping in the actual Victoria's Secret store and not online because at the one that I went to in Austin it was really really clean and all the employees were like sanitizing stuff and everyone was wearing masks. It was just so clean. Honestly I kind of liked being able to get out of my house and go shopping in an actual store because originally I was just going to order stuff online but online they don't have anything in my size and the stuff is not as cute and I think there's less selection. So I'd recommend going in the store if you feel comfortable doing that. I felt really comfortable and safe. But I picked up a decent amount of things. I didn't really get too much stuff because even though I went in the store where there was more selection, they still didn't have as much as they usually do, I think. I feel like there were less things on sale that might be because of like what's going on. They might just like not have as much stuff in the stores. I'm not really sure. But anyways, um, I'm pretty sure pretty much everything I got was half off. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I got things from Victoria's Secret and Pink. So I'm going to show you all the Victoria's Secret stuff first. And the first thing that I have are these satin sleeve shorts. They just look like this. And I got them in a size small and they run pretty big so honestly I could have gotten an extra small in these and they were only $25. I'm pretty sure all of the sleep separates were $25 each I think. At least these were $25. But I love them. I also have them in red. I got the red ones for Christmas I think or Valentine's Day. But they're just honestly so comfortable and I was wearing them before I started filming this video, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put them back on now. So anyways, the next things that I have are bras and I got one pair of underwear, so I get these kind of bras from Victoria's Secret usually. They're unlined and they're just lacy. And this bra is so, so pretty. It is a little bit see-through, but since it's black, um, you can't really like see anything, but I mean, you're gonna wear it under clothes anyways. I just think it's so pretty like look at that it's just the cutest bra ever and it's unlined so yeah there's no padding I don't like bras with padding because it's uncomfortable to me and personally I just think that lacy bras with no pads are just honestly the prettiest kinds of bras that you can buy and I got it in a 32c and this one was half off so instead of being $70 it was like $35 $35 is still kind of pricey, but I'm just going to have to take really good care of it and not wash it with all of my clothes. I have little garment bag things that I put my bras in so that they don't get messed up. So anyways, that was the first bra. And then the next bra that I got is very similar to that one, but it's just white and tan. Sorry if you can hear noise. My neighbor's children are playing outside and they're yelling so I can't really do anything about that but this is the other one so it's just like this and it's very very pretty and it was also $35 I think this one is actually in a size that's a little bit too big for me but I wanted it really badly here it is it's just so pretty and I think this is called the unlined uplift bra because even though it's unlined, it has this little panel thing that holds your boobs up and like in place. But this is just so pretty. Like, oh my gosh, I just really love it. And then to go with that bra, I have these underwear. So these were $15, which is also kind of a lot for just a pair of underwear. So together the set was like 50 bucks, but it would have been a lot more expensive if it wasn't on sale, but this is what they look like. So they just have this white lining thing. And I saw this set online, but they were sold out of it in like pretty much every size. So I'm so happy that I found it in the store, but they're just so pretty. And then the back looks like this. 
so i highly recommend this if you see it in the store but it does run pretty big because this is a small and it just looks like super wide so that's all for the underwear and then oh yeah i also got one lounge top from victoria's secret so my mom got the same exact one as me and it just looks like this it's really oversized and boxy i got this in an extra small and even though it's an extra small it's still really big but that's how it's supposed to fit and the price of this one was originally 44 so it was about 22 dollars i just love this it's a really nice quality little lounge top i definitely wear this with high-waisted leggings to class if i get to experience walking to class again hopefully but i just love it it's very very cute and comfortable and it feels really nice like the quality of it and everything is super nice so moving on i have three things from the Victoria's Secret pink section. So this shirt was $10, it's just gray. Looks like this. It's just very basic. This isn't an extra small and it does run kind of big. It's supposed to be a fitted shirt, but it's not that fitted. I mean it is, but I was expecting it to be like a little bit more tighter and a little bit more cropped. But I still like it and just something simple to wear with jeans and then the last two tops I absolutely love I actually tried this one on so it's a little bit wrinkly but these are both $20 and they're just from the active wear line so it's a cropped long sleeve dry fit stretchy shirt I love wearing these when I go on runs in the fall slash winter I'll just wear this with like high-waisted shorts or something and it keeps you really nice and warm without overheating you and they kind of remind me of the Gymshark ones I actually have some Gymshark shirts like this, but These ones are honestly they feel better and they're cuter and they're also a lot more affordable So yeah, it was originally $40. So it was $20 when it was on sale and then I also have it in this gray color and it's just so nice. I really, really am excited to wear these. These are also perfect for when you go to the gym and you're warming up and you don't wanna like be in a sports bra yet, you can have this on top. And then once you're like warm, you can just take it off and it's perfect. So that is everything that I got from the Victoria's Secret sale this year. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you guys next time.